Follow my finger with your eyes without moving your head. I'm Dr. Joelle Salinas, a neurologist at Massachusetts General Hospital. Since I was a kid, I always had the sense there was something different or odd about me. Keep it right there for a little bit. I remember kind of watching cartoons as a kid. I watch Wally Coyote and I feel like if he gets hit by a truck, I get hit by a truck. I first learned about synesthesia during my first year in medical school. Two out of 100 people have what's called mirror touch synesthesia. It is a glitch in my brain's wiring where I feel physically on my body what I see other people feeling. So for example, if you are gasping for air, I feel like I'm gasping for air. If you're having a panic attack, I feel like I'm having a panic attack. Growing up, I always felt motivated to help relieve some of that suffering. When I see a new type of patient in the hospital, that experience can be really distressing because I feel like it's happening to me. Don't let me pull. But in, in that response, I have to kind of ground myself in my own physical body. But I get to be a part of some of this pain and suffering as well. And I think in a, as a part of that, the patients get to be a little less alone. That means a lot in medicine.